about your fantastic unique car what inspired you to create this masterpiece um i really like all the uh rat rod scene yeah I just, and uh, I just noticed this. <laughs> and i've so, noticed in this country they don't really do it the same as the americans right yeah um obviously because of laws and things like that but i just love it so i thought why not do it myself but on a budget on a budget not. so what sort of you know you've obviously spent thousands doing this have you no 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 not thousands um i bought the car for about just over 200 quid right okay and, wow uh, i'll give myself a 500 pound all in all budget 500 quid so modified car 500 quid all in yes challenge is on isn't it Ch well it's, it's nearly there <laughs> it's getting there bit by bit but um yeah i've just bits and bobs here and there what i've had ideas um i thought crazy things like that never had never seen one with a drink holder before yeah. i make one out of wood Varnish have you it, spoke to in. fords about the drink holder to see if they'd be interested in the pattern no, or no definitely not <laughs> i don't think they would be but so what's next any uh final tweaks i think it's got to be quicker it's got to be quicker yeah <laughs> it's got to be a true Okay. That rod kind of real thing. And most of the mods you've done all yourself. Yeah, I've done everything. You haven't taken myself. it to a custom shop to build it, no. No, I've done it all myself. Sprayed it, made everything. Um, yeah, a bit crazy here and there. And uh, the coke cans and the Fanta cans and stuff. I think they're fantastic. Is that easy to do? Uh, yeah, basically they're the same dimension. So you know, drink it, cut it out, put the gauge in. Recycling. <laughs> Simple. Yeah, Recycling that's it. All it costs over, nothing. I think a pod holder costs on now about Obviously you quid. didn't drink this and then drive it home. <laughs> no. no, okay, just checking. No, it's uh, just uh it's just an idea and I thought I'd go with it. Yeah. You do like like a straw or something, you fill yeah. it with orange, <laughs> orange juice. I wouldn't open that because I'd probably be toxic in there. <laughs> <laughs> Hasn't been washed out, so fantastic. Well Richard, I, I think this is a fantastic car and for five hundred quid. Um you've done an amazing job. Thank you very uh, much. Um, you know, it, it's very unique, it's a one off. It's all done by love, and you can see that. And it's definitely a love or hate job, isn't it? Yeah. So for exactly, there's it's gonna be people out that are gonna hate all yes. over this, and there's gonna be people out that are gonna love all over I this. Mean, so I've just noticed, like, you know, if you got stuck in a fold, I've just noticed that there is an oar on the roof, so we could always like <laughs> <Why not? laughs> get out. You know what I mean? It's and all, enough wood to build a boat, nearly. Yeah, so it's, uh, it's an all-terrain vehicle. All recycled, all recycled yeah, stuff. Yeah, it's fantastic. Well, I can't wait to see it at the next show, and I think we should uh, we should have uh, some sort of trophy at the next show for. <laughs> homegrown, self-build rat rods. Well, I think we should also have anyone who thinks they can build something better for 500 pound in a budget, comment below, we'll come and find you. Yeah. yeah. Thanks for subscribing, we'll see you soon.